Hi, this is Sylvester. He is a little man, a little guy, a little goober, as you can see. Little dude. Hi, I forgot to mention timestamps. You can skip to the timestamps, okay? That is very important. <laughs> I fucking ramble for way too long, I'm sorry. Phone is at 20%. Anyways, hi. I want to start doing more um, live action content. <laughs> so that, that, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, I really hate being downstairs. So most of the video we're gonna, not, I'm not even gonna be down here, it's just me talking, you know, like a lunatic. So, that's fun. It's dark and spooky. I have this little cat thing to protect me. It looks like cat sound, and it flashbangs people. And you can hold the button and just repeat cat sound over and over again. So, it's useful, it's good. I bring for comment. Like as you can see, he's beautiful. He is obese. And I love him. It's very hard to hold him with one arm, so I have to, you know, cradle him like a baby. His stomach is shaped like a heart though. So that's cool. I still hope he's really heavy. I can't hold him for that long. Hold him for a moment. Anyways. I wanted to turn this little sprinkles container into a pot for a plant I wanted to grow. Uh, snap peas, sugar snap peas, I wanted to grow those. So I thought, let's make it a pot. I don't think this pot is big enough for it, but I can always move it if I need to, you know, make a new pot for it. Um, I'll show you what I, I had to move the sprinkles into because this was like, this still had sprinkles in it. I had to move it out of, out of this and put it into this other sprinkling container. This one has some like really nasty shit in it. It did not taste good <laughs> at all. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's let's go. Let's go upstairs. Let's go do this so I don't have to be down here because it's scary. Hi, so it's the next day. Um these are my my seeds that I might be planting. So that is a rutabaga right there in the middle. Like right there. The that one right there. And then the green ones are uh, sugar snap peas. Those seeds right there that haven't started sprouting it. Those are, are uh, carrots, I think. <laughs> and then those are supposed to be uh, onion, onion seeds. So these haven't sprouted. These have. It's been like three days. So this is a lot. And then also have um, some in this bag. These are rutabagas. They grew in the dirt originally, so then I moved them. But then there's there's some sprouting in there. <laughs> yeah, let's just go back to my window. And then that's just dead grass. Okay, that was dead grass. Hi, so the first thing I did was I, I poked holes in the bottom of it so the water could, um, escape so when it gets stuck and the roots won't mold uh i also sanded the whole thing with a a nail filer because i did not have uh, i could not find my sandpaper so that was irritating <laughs> so i had to use a nail file uh then i got my paint out this was fun i had to do so many freaking layers of the goddamn colors i painted it Fully yellow first, because I thought it was a nice shade of yellow. It is a nice shade of yellow, but yeah, I'm gonna leave you guys to, to watch the time lapse of me painting it.
also paint the lid, which is going to be the thing that holds all the water at the bottom. I also painted that yellow as well because it has to match. Duh. I got some barbecue skewers. I cut them to size and then I I got ready to to attach them together cuz this is going to be one of those those thingies that hold up vines cuz I plan on putting the snap peas in there. And when they grow, they they're going to need something to hold on to. So that's the the little thingy that holds it. I marked it down on the popsicle sticks cuz I'm going to use those to um help connect everything and make it more seamless. Uh, the Gorilla Glue was not working with that at first, so that was irritating. And I had to get, go get some um, some beads from a... I, I dropped my phone while recording, okay. Um, <laughs> I had to go get some beads from a bracelet making kit. My dog walked in the room, sorry for her heavy breathing. Um, <laughs> and I had to hold it down with Elmer's glue and the Gorilla Glue because the grid glue still wasn't working. I didn't learn my lesson right here. I had to go find that <laughs> the Elmer's glue stick, hold that down, and I covered it with the Gorilla Glue too. <laughs> and I did that for uh, both of them. Yeah, you can watch it happen. I get out the bottle caps to hold the popsicle sticks and I start painting them green. It's gonna be green. Why? Because it's gonna blend in with the plant. It's gonna look nice. Hopefully. I hope. Dear God, please. Please look nice. part i was trying to make it more strong which it worked in the long run but i broke it in the process yeah so that's lovely you're about to watch that happen <laughs> uh, yeah it's uh, I, I was not mad when it happened though definitely not mad at all because then i gotta do what i wanted to do so it worked out for me it's just i couldn't do that to the second piece paint the whole thing green to match the popsicle sticks so much green so so much green yeah there's not much to commentate about the green so bye <laughs>
once everything was nice and painted, I started to get the popsicle sticks onto the thing. So I used my rubber bands and I helped. Uh, uh, fuck, I, I don't know how to words, but I did that to them. I put them in there, help hold them in place, you know, you know. Yeah, you're watching that happen. Whoa, so cool, so exciting. Uh, and then I put the Gorilla Glue on it afterwards. I think the Gorilla Glue was melting the rubber bands because they were breaking, but it was staying together. So, I mean, technically it was working. That's all that mattered to me. <laughs> And then I painted it green again after. Because green! Woo! After that, to connect to, I got back out them beads and the Elmer's glue stick, and I fucking stuck them together the best I could. Had to hold it a little bit. It worked. It worked out. I also put the rubber bands on there um, to, to, to help me keep it in place after I got them, like, glued together. Yeah. Yeah. We are painting the fun part on the pot, the stripes, the pretty part. Um, I did go in with the, I, I did not know what I was doing. I winged it, bruh, but I had to go over it a lot of times to get it as pigmented as I wanted it to be. So yeah. <laughs> also have the the lid being painted which is important so yay and then i went in with the blue and i i um i painted it blue i do a little i did a little heart that part like you're barely gonna see so i guess it doesn't matter that i painted it but it still looks cute I also put blue on the main pot on like with stripes just like I, I did the, the pink had to go over that a, a billion jillion times too twas annoying but worth it I guess how to stop fucking recording bitch said we do earlier yeah isn't that neat that's so it stays together more i was trying to figure out how to put that on but i couldn't i i guess i stretched yeah then i covered it in glue more glue yay of waiting for it to dry i painted it because i was not being patient i did not let it dry all the way but yeah so this is a jump cut too after i did a ton of layers this is just me doing more layers really cleaning it up you know trying my best yeah it, it took a lot to even get it that pigmented, so that that's why most of it's cut out. <laughs>
also painted the pot because that is also important. Next, I put these little like yellow dots all over the, the green thingy because I thought it looked cute. It looks like flowers, you know. I decide I'm gonna also do it to the the lid and stuff and I hated it at first I still kind of do but I, I made it work I guess so I actually lost a lot of footage because I kept on running out of storage and my phone kept on dying <laughs> so I also did it to the the pot lid and I went over it with a lighter purple to like layer it up and make it look like flowers and stuff which you'll kind of be able to see if I actually show you but this is me painting on more in a different color uh there's the lid the lid did not work out the same way the the, the pot did the pot looks way better <laughs> I paint some purple thingies on the green thingy so yay I thought it looked cute and it does it looks like little flowers it worked out um, it matches <laughs> now we get to go in with the little details and add these little stripes next to the the original colors of like a lighter version of them it looks cute i like it um i kept on fucking up and having to go over and make it cleaner so yeah but i did it <laughs>
is it not sped up at all, by the way? So, um, yeah. I, I spent a while on this. And to end it off, I put some puffy paint on top so like I wouldn't cut myself on the plastic just, like, just in case it was still a little sharp, you know? It's done, by the way. I'll show you guys it in like an update video, I guess, when the plant is fully grown and alive. Okay, bye. Here's the bloopers. Ah. <laughs> My cats are having zoomies. Hi, I forgot to add add in. Um. <laughs> I think that's just not free. What the fuck? What are you doing? Sylvester. Dude, stop! Why are you trying to eat a soda block? What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. It's getting shit out of me. Oh, I'm a... <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'll just restart. I'll just restart. Hi, motherfucker. Send. You got. Anyway.